Hi, my name is Brittany. So today I'm going to talk to you about the healing powers of raw cacao. Did you know that raw cacao is a superfood? So when cacao has uh, become cooked, it actually loses a lot of its nutrients. It's, so if it's raw, it will actually contain high sources of magnesium. It will have uh, a certain amount of protein and fiber. It will have uh, copper. It will have zinc. It'll have um, a whole series of different nutrients in it. In fact, uh, the ancient Mayans would use the um, the raw cacao, uh, obviously as an aphrodisiac, um, and also to um, you know boost the happy um, pheromones. But beyond that, actually, it was it was a high energy superfood. So this would give them so many different nutrients and so much energy that it would um be able to to make them stay healthy um for longer amounts of time they'd be able to get more work done and and uh, not become too tired so fast and so easily and um but again your uh, cacao is only going to be a superfood if you know for a fact that what you are buying and eating is fair trade organic non-GMO and local if at all possible and if you can you need to try to find it and buy it as well as being raw and if you can you need to try to find it and buy it and eat it without sugarcane so either with raw honey or add your own raw honey or something but do not buy and eat cacao with sugarcane because it's usually going to be so processed that it's no longer by that time a superfood anymore and by that time it's just kind of a processed candy by that time so if you want to be able to enjoy a sweet treat even if it costs you a little bit more and not feel guilty about it for the environment or your dental health or um, or anything else make sure what you're buying is organic non-gmo raw no sugar cane either raw honey sweetened or sweetened with coconut sugar. They sometimes have that with some brands. Um, but you really got to read the labels, people. Reading the labels is so important because they lie about so many things and so many things that would be sold at all these different health food stores. You'd think they're all safe and don't contain any sugar cane, but you'd be surprised. Huge percentage of stuff, even that's sold at the organic health food stores, not all of it is healthy. So you really have to read everything. And then also pay attention to how you're feeling. Every time you're um, buying something and trying it and eating and drinking it, you know, are you feeling more healthy and more energized or are you feeling more sick? And see, I have always been sensitive to stuff since I was a little kid. So I have noticed, especially as I've gotten older, really, really paid attention that if something is really healthy and good for me, I know that usually it's going to be from local companies if at all possible but at least always organic non-gmo fair trade uh, no sugar cane added because those factors at least are very very important and raw if at all possible so for your digestive health um, the raw cacao is a lot easier on your digestive health than the cacao that has been cooked so cacao that's been cooked is um, going to make, make you get more breakouts and cacao that has a bunch of sugar cane in it is going to be um, more likely to create a bunch of breakouts for the body. But if you want to try to reduce your um, breakouts and um, feeling sick and getting a stomachache, you need to make sure that what you're getting is um, organic, non-GMO, raw, no sugar cane, fair trade, if at all possible, that you're lucky to live in an area where you can get stuff locally made and get it organic and get it without sugar cane and get it raw, then you need to do that. Even if it costs you a little bit more, it's going to save your health and save the environment. And it's going to be keeping uh, your local economy going. So supporting local, organic, uh, good-hearted individuals and businesses is so important. I know it sometimes costs more and it's sometimes harder to find them, but... Trust me when I say the flavor and taste of everything is so much better and um, 
you know, it just makes you sleep better at night knowing that you're supporting local economies, local business, protecting the environment, protecting your health and protecting the health of everybody else because they're not allowed to just do whatever because it's cheaper. And see, when you have um, businesses and companies that are held accountable for what they are doing, then you're more likely to stay safe and healthy from it. And it's a good thing to invest in and to support. So everybody buy local as much as you can. Buy fair trade and organic and non-GMO. No sugar cane added. Read your labels. I mean it. Read your labels every day, all the time. Before you buy something, try to read your labels. And um, yeah, get your stuff raw as much as possible because the flavor and the taste is going to be so much better. Your digestive health will be so much better and your energy levels will be much better and higher if you can find stuff that is raw instead of over processed with tons of sugar cane and uh, overcooked and everything. So have a good day.